Hi, today I'll be explaining my script for LLM uh, with ROS integration with a proof of concept. So what happened is uh, this script actually creates a simple interactive chat interface with Nairo Robot Assistant using OpenAI language. So the libraries used is OpenAI and uh, import OS and uh, .env. OpenAI actually uses the OpenAI GPT API model to interact with uh, the chat. Uh, OS and EMV actually loads the environment from uh, another script called .env. And this is actually used here that we actually load uh, the API key from another script for another environment. Next uh, is the generate response function. Uh, this function actually uses OpenAI API to generate a response based on user input message and conversation history. It actually calls out the GPT-3 model to get a chat completion and extract the assistant's reply to generate uh, the response. Next uh, are the uh, functions. The functions are actually, uh, I actually put move up, move down, open gripper, close gripper, and it's used to indicate uh, correspond corresponding uh, robot actions. The actions are actually not real, but it's used to implement, uh, to demonstrate a real robot. It's uh, used as a concept of generating robot actions based on text uh, response from like return. Next is the chat assistant. It actually initialized the conversation with a system message explaining how the user can interact with the assistant. What happened is you enter a loop, then from the loop, you will actually, user will be able to uh, enter a message. From the message, what you will do is actually open the open AI API to get a response. Then from the response, you will generate uh, the action if uh, it hits the certain keywords in the uh, generator response from the API. We can also see from here the message where the AI is uh, told that it is uh, running a role of a system and this is the content There is actually a narrow robot and what actions are there that is included and the format that is over print up. So from here, the AI actually understands the content before responding so that the response will be relevant from what we need. So how it works is the user will provide input uh, into the assistant. Then you actually generate a sequence of actions separated by then and n, as you can see from here, the keywords. So this is actually used if the user has a chain of commands, it will, uh, the AI will be able to separate and uh, put them in order. So what happens is the script actually sends this input into OpenAI API to generate a response. The response is actually, after that, then used to extract the individual actions and corresponding robot functions that call through the function. So if there is several actions that are supposed to be taken, the actions will be split apart then it will be running the the loop will be able to run the first action then you will rerun, rerun the loop into a second second action and the last action then after that if the user want to exit uh exit the conversation the user can type exit okay now i'll be demonstrating So from here, we can see that the robot assistant actually prompts you first. So let's say I want the robot to move up. So what happens is uh, based on the input we send into the chat open AI, it will come back into the format that we need, we want. And uh, let's say the format is move up. Based on this, the AI will be able to understand and prompt back then you'll run the function based on the 